What's going on, Mother Truckers? Welcome to the Asian My Show. I met this very, very great guy, man. You're so nice, Pat, man. Thanks. You really are. And Thank you. so, you know, for people that don't know you, please introduce yourself. Okay, I'm Pat Dalton. I come out of Harvard Heights, Illinois. This is a 2000 Ford F 350 four door. I've never seen a truck look like this. It's kind ever of different. in my life. Is this the only one in America? This or is the, the only one that was ever built. About five years ago, I built this. Yeah, we 19 months to build it. It's a 7.3 power stroke. Let's walk it. Let's walk yeah, it. Yeah, it's a 2000. And um, it took me 19, like I said, 19 months to build it. It um, got a 7.3 power stroke. Uh, I stretched the frame 10 feet 8 inches. The wheelbase is 276. Um, studio sleeper, the biggest one I could pick up to fit on my truck. And um, it was a little bit of love involved and uh, fully functional. I carry 126 gallons of diesel fuel. Wait, let me see, let's, let's, let's look at this. How okay. does that look? I have the original on the side, and in the back here, I have a 91 gallon tank. And it goes all the way? It goes all the way across. To the other side? To the other side. I'll shut off the compressor, because I got air right in the trunk. I got air right front and air right in the back. Okay. So. Uh, there was a little bit of fabrication being done because you know what Ford, they stop right here. So we had to sheet metal all this here to be straight with the boot because it'd be two inches down here and six inches above or seven inches above. Then we struck the frame and uh, we beefed that frame up. I got five cross members across the sleeper. This studio is so heavy that we didn't know, so we had to build it up a lot stronger, you know what I mean? But it's a six speed, and we got air right in front, air right in the back, and I have a valve that I front tank and the rear tank I can turn on with just a switch. And uh, it really rides nice. We might have to go for a ride in a little bit. Yeah, can we do we that? Might, yeah, we can go for a ride. The wheelbase is 276, in other words, 23 feet long. 23 feet long. Yeah, of, uh, yeah. I and, tell you, uh, the overall length is 30 feet six inches. That's crazy. 30 feet six inches is the is the overall length of the truck. Well, let's check out the interior real yeah. quick. Let's start from the front and then open from the back, okay. right? Okay. It's a, a six speed manual air ride. Now, just remember, this is a, a 2000. You know what I mean? So I got air ride in front, air lift in the back, and of course. <laughs> Yeah. Air horns. Air horns. I love it. And then in the back here, it's fully functional. You walk right in the back. Can we walk in? Sure. I'll move that crate for you. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Uh-huh. I'll move that crate. Go ahead, kiddo. You walk right in. Look at this, y'all. So you can see, it's a complete sofa, bed, dresser, height of bed up above. You got some lights going on? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. let me go back here yeah. to give people yeah. a glimpse. This thing's mad crazy, brother. It's well, kind of different. It's kind of different. What we got under the hood? Uh, here we go. Uh, we got a 7.3. Nothing was done with the engine. Nothing. It's stock 7.3 power stroke. I just put a coal air intake, a AFE coal air intake. Yeah. But I put an exhaust brake, like a Jake brake. 
by Banks. Banks exhaust brake. But uh, everything was stock on the motor. I'd never touched the motor at all. And uh, then I put another W800 bumper on the front end. I customized that bumper and uh, I had to actually bend the corners and weld them. And then I went to AIH Chrome and uh, had them re-chromed the whole bumper. And then I had to fabricate this bumper because with Ford, the bumper stops here. Well, I had to build this all out. So I had to take C-channel and back back and weld it together to extend the bumper. But then, um, you know, do, with everything you have to work on and stuff like that to make sure it works right. And then I put 05 headlights on. These are not the 2000, these are 05s on the headlights. I love it, I love it, man. So I got five inch, I got 23 feet of five inch pipe under the truck. Then we go to a Y, which is five inch. And then I went from five and six up, eight foot. So these are six inches here with these miter cuts. I and they're it. both functional. You guys get inside, I'll turn this on, and you can see all the gauges that I hooked up. Yeah. All these are mechanical. All these are mechanical gauges. Every every six of these are all mechanical. That's great. For water temperature and trans temperature and fuel. Boost. I got all six of these. All six of these work. I love all it. six. I love it. No, I thank you so much. Thank you for interviewing me. Of thank course, you. of course.